Thank you for watching this intriguing film about Tesla's future. Tesla is a firm that revolutionized the auto industry and is currently a global leader in renewable energy. The movie analyzes Tesla's ability to rule the market with a subscription-based service for fully autonomous driving (FSD) software that can be downloaded into the vehicle and produce a profit margin of 60% by 2030. Additionally, Tesla's energy business is booming with over $100 billion in projected income for the year 2023 alone. The financial outlook for Tesla is discussed in the film, along with how having this knowledge can give you the power to retire early. Join us as we explore Tesla's fascinating universe and its possibilities for future success. I want to see you click the like button and subscribe to Tesla before we begin. For FSD, a subscription-based service makes sense. Tesla acknowledges that there isn't enough information to completely support this hypothesis, but based on estimates, they believe the profit margin will reach 60% by 2030, which is pure profit. FSD can be downloaded as software onto a vehicle. I'm confident that by 2030, FSD will be regulated and Tesla's profit margin may even increase. Additionally, Tesla Energy continues to claim that in 2022, it generated approximately $4 billion in total revenue and nearly $300 billion in profit during the last quarter of the year with a 12% margin. They anticipate earning $7.5 billion at a 12% margin in 2023 and $11.5 billion at a 13% margin in 2024, increasing by 50% year until 2030. I estimate that in 2023, overall revenue will exceed $100 billion. Tesla will nevertheless incur FX currency costs, which will lower its net profitability in 2023. Their estimate for Tesla's payment is close to $1.5 billion, which will result in a drop in net income from over $17 billion to slightly under $16 billion. I anticipate that this cost will go up every year, but they are hopeful that lower entrance fees would result in a weaker US dollar and lower costs. Again, in my opinion, Tesla shares will continue to dilute it by 2% annually from 2023 to 2030 with no dividends or buybacks. By the end of the decade, they anticipate that Tesla will have earned over $750 billion in total income from FSD energy and vehicles, which is a conservative estimate. Think about the further projects Tesla has in mind, like the robot. Moving on to fully autonomous driving, I anticipate that the one-time cost will be close to $30,000 by 2030. Even though some people may find this forecast absurd, full self-driving cost $8,000 in 2020. The cost increased to $15,000 by the end of 2022, virtually doubling. I'm using a value of $12,500 for my projection to be as conservative as possible given what the average price will be in 2022. Within the following seven years, I predict that the price will increase by another doubling, if not more. The FSD profit margin will increase to up to 60% by 2030, producing pure profit. This is so that by 2030, the car will be able to drive itself because FSD is software that can be updated into the vehicle. You will be able to travel with the car, and it will be controlled. By 2030, I anticipate that Tesla will have a profit margin of up to $38 billion because I think it can find a solution to this problem. Along with FSD, Tesla's energy business is booming. They generated approximately $4 billion in revenue and profits in 2022, and in the final quarter of that year, they achieved an absurd margin of 12%. They will generate $7.5 billion in total revenue in 2023, with a 12% margin according to my forecast. As a result, 2023 as a whole will generate $900 million. I estimate total revenue of $11.5 billion in 2024, with a 13% margin or roughly $1.5 million. From that point forward, through 2030, the sales will grow by 50% year, as will the profit margin. Because Tesla has stated that they hope to match the current 20% revenue of the energy sector with their vehicles, I'm also being conservative with this forecast. By 2023, it might, however, be much higher than that. I think Tesla will surpass $100 billion in revenue overall, 
which would be a fantastic accomplishment. It appears like Tesla will have a successful decade ahead of it. We're talking about more than $750 billion in sales just from their car and energy businesses. The impending Tesla bot and other initiatives are not even mentioned. We must, however, exercise caution when it comes to earnings. By the conclusion of this, I think that by the end of 2030, year will have generated over $17 billion in revenue. Profits will total more than $170 billion. We must, however, take into account the currency expense because it would reduce our revenue in 2023. For instance, we'll spend close to $1.5 billion on currency charges alone. Our income will drop from nearly $17 billion to slightly around $16 billion as a result. However, in the big picture, it doesn't really make a difference. Let's now discuss shares. There will be a 2% dilution every year between 2023 and 2030. No dividends and no buybacks. In terms of EPS, it was 4.70 in 2022. By the end of this year, I predict that we will have 4.86 EPS, and by the year 2030, we should have nearly 47 EPS. That's very amazing. Let's now discuss the price of the stock in 2022. Tesla had a difficult year, as the stock fell by roughly 70 to 80%. Tesla shares traded at an average price of $204 per share and a 50 PE. It did drop to $102 per share at one point, but since the entire fiscal year was still open, it may fall considerably worse. However, you would have roughly 49 shares if you had bought $10,000 in Tesla stock at a price of $204 per share. By the end of the year, or the first quarter of 2024, you might have made a respectable profit given the stock's current range of $180 to $170. With inflation decreasing in the Federal Reserve, I predict that the stock market will turn positive and pause at a PE of 60 and a stock price of $292 per share. The market value of Tesla would be close to $1 trillion. Your $10,000 initial investment would become over $14,000 if this were to occur. A 40% return. You might still earn a substantial return of 20% even if the stock stays inside the zero pounds and 50 pence range. However, I think that in 2024, Tesla's stock might hit an extremely optimistic PE of 65, a share price of $478, and a market valuation of more than $1.5 trillion. Your initial investment would be worth more than $23,500 if this occurs. In 2025, a return rate of roughly 230%. I estimated a market valuation of roughly $2.2 trillion, a PE of 60, and a stock price of $650 per share. It's absurd that your $10,000 investment would now be valued close to $32,000. If the market becomes extremely positive by 2026, Tesla may divide its stock, perhaps 4 to 1. I anticipate a PE of 55, an average share price of $828, and a market size of more than $2.8 trillion. Over five times what you started with in 2027, your first investment is now worth over $52,000. I anticipate a market valuation of $3.7 trillion, a PE of 50, and a share price of $1,061 per share. With a PE of 35, your investment would now be worth over $73,000 more than it did when you first made it. I anticipate a market valuation of more than $6 trillion and a share price of $6,332 per share. By 2030, your $10,000 investment would have increased by about 800% to almost $80,000 in value. I realize this may sound crazy, but the huge growth potential in Tesla stock is the reason I'm going all in. You might still get a return of 40%, which would still be spectacular, even if just half of my predictions come true. Anyhow, those are just a few figures I've been examining. The following few years will be intriguing to see as things develop. Our study of Tesla's potential is now complete, especially in light of their successful energy sector and subscription-based service for fully autonomous driving technologies.
While some projections may appear overly optimistic, it is obvious that Tesla has enormous growth and profitability potential in the years to come. Expenses like currency must be taken into account, but overall, things are looking up. I appreciate your attention. In our upcoming video, we aim to include you.